This is the week four edition of Inside NWSL Video Review. The match is played from April 12th to the 14th. I'm Greg Barkey, Pro's Manager of Video Review. Just a single review in the seven games, and it happened in the added time of Bay Football Club versus Seattle Rain. Good. Mm -hmm. Handball? Possible handball? Okay, so can we go back? Delay, delay, delay. Okay, Okay. so if we could, right, so just freeze it when her arm goes up, and I have clear contact with it. We have goal on the field. Right here, yeah. And play it through. And bring it back one more time. They will check. Okay, and 25%? Yep. Yes, clear handball. Arms above the arm, or arms check. above the head. So we have goal. I think they're arguing for a possible handball. Okay. Kacha, this is Alyssa. I'm going to yeah. recommend a review for a handball in the APP. So we're going to show yeah, her the tight right here. Just and we're going to show video her. Video. Yeah, just, we'll show her this right here. Just, just let us know when you're there. there. Yeah, I'm here. And play. Okay. Play. Oh, uh, no, I need a bigger loop. Come back. Oh, Come back. Wait, bigger I'm loop. sorry. You, you broke up. What did you say? Bigger loop. Bigger loop. Yeah, play now. Perfect. Okay, thank you. Yep. No worries. So she's going to come out with a direct free kick midfield. No goal. Boom. Osisa Nochala of Bay FC committed a handball offense in the attacking phase of play when she blocked a clearance by Lauren Barnes of Seattle before going on to score. Her arm was in an unnatural position above her shoulders when it blocked the ball, which is important to note because this is a deliberate handball offense, which is different from an attacker handball, since this would not be considered an immediate goal. That's all for a short NWSL Inside Video Review Week 4. For more information on Pro in the NWSL, you can go to ProReferees.com.